Bonjour, welcome to our toy. We've got six quality races coming up from here today, and the first one is the Carmarthen Hurdle. It's two miles and three furlongs, a Grade Two event. And uh, Attorney General Paul Rhodes is the top one. Black Rain, Molly at Surfer, Eight the Stag, Joshua Sutherland, Holly West, Graham Clutterbuck, Legends Mark, Derek Hinton, Zalano Beat, Alex Cherry, Banana Split, Kevin Minahan, Eskimo Jane, David Robertson, Moon Fairy, Marty Lidham, Pickpocket, Leon Van Rensburg, and Western Gate Jim Murray. Away they go then, and. Making their way towards the first flight. It's a pretty short run to the first, and they're all over it safely. And they've got 11 more to take, 12 to take it all in this race. Then, and Eskimo Jane has raced into a couple of length lead already, and now three, probably even four clear now. Seems to be set on putting the pace to the race. You can see the Eiffel Tower in the background, and Zalano beat. Oh, it's gone! Zalano beat was, I was just about to say, Zalano beat was chasing the leader. And looked like he was going to challenge for the lead, and he's just gone straight through that hurdle. I've never seen many fallers like that at hurdle races, and Zelano beat crashes out early on, so bad luck for Alex Cherry. And Eskimo Jane is the leader then by about five to Western Gate in second, and the two greys after that are Pickpocket and Legends Mark, with Attorney General on the inside as they take number three, and they're all safely over that one, with Eskimo Jane a good five lengths clear. To Western Gate in second, and then Pickpocket and Legends Mark. Attorney General on the inside, Black Rain in the Molly at Surfer colours, Moon Fairy in the green on the wide outside. And over on the rail is Eight the Stag. Between the two of those is Banana Split in the green with the orange hoop, and the back marker is Holly West in those Welsh flag colours of Graham Clutterbuck. So Eskimo Jane it is then, who takes us over the fourth with a clear lead. Slightly diminished after the jumps though there as the remainder of the field seemed to jump it slightly better than the leader and over the fifth it jumped it okay, all jumped it okay in fact. And Eskimo Jane continues to show the way to pickpocket and legends mark Western Gate on the inside. Attorney General has moved to the outside. Moon Fairy is just after them. And then comes Black Rain out the stag and banana split with Holly West. Just the back marker as they take the sixth, and I'm pretty sure that'll be the le the, the, the next, the, ne the last on <laughs> the next circuit as they pass the winning post in a big screen. I'm oh, sorry, the wine is being flowed quite freely here at Oi Toy. May have just got into the um, commentator's bloodstream a little bit there as we can a little one or two little. <laughs> Vocal errors about lasts and necks and stuff. And while I'm doing that, they've jumped the seventh, and Eskimo Jane is the leader. From Western Gate in second, uh, Legends Mark third, Pickpocket four. As they jump number eight, and they're all over that one okay as well. With just four more to go now, then. And seven furlongs to race, and Eskimo Jane continues to lead by three parts of a length to Western Gate in second. And then Legends Mark a couple of lengths back in third with Pickpocket four and Banana Split five. And then you've got eight, the Stag, Moon Fairy and Black Rain all in a line. And the back two are Attorney General and Holly West. But a wide open race still as they take the ninth. And they're all over that one okay. And a little more than five furlongs still to race. And Eskimo Jane is yet to be headed. Legends Mark on the outside. And Hollywood Hinton's horses do seem to have stepped up a gear this year, don't they? He seems to be in and around everything at the moment. Hollywood is doing really well. Moon Fairy chases in third, pickpocket on the inside. Western Gates lost its place and is dropping back alarmingly quickly for a Jim Murray horse. And over the third last they go, and Eskimo Jane lands in the lead with Legends Mark in hot pursuit in second. Pickpocket is third, Black Rain is next. The Jim Murray horse, Western Gate, starting to run on again now. There's only one more flight to take and two furlongs to go. And Legends Mark's taken it up and it's got the lead from Eskimo Jane. But Eskimo Jane fights back. Eskimo Jane on the inside from Legends Mark. Pickpocket, here comes Western Gate and Nate the Stag. It's between these. They race down towards the final flight then now. And suddenly Western Gate, who looked beaten a furlong ago, he's now got a second wind and jumps the final flight. Lands in front. It's Nate the Stag trying to close. But Western Gate may have won this a bit cannily, I think, as they race up towards the line. And Western Gate takes it. Curious win there. Eight the stack second, pickpocket third, Eskimo Jane fourth, Black Rain was next. And well, Western Gate looked like it was totally beaten. Two out. And has come back in 
great style for Jim Murray. So Western Gate, the winner for Jim Murray. Hate the Stag for Joshua Sutherland, second. Pickpocket for Leon Van Rensburg was third. Eskimo Jane David Rawson, fourth. And Legends Mark for Derek Hinton was fifth.